Hey guys, Pixar Prime 10 here, and uh, today I'm doing a quick video. And but uh, you guys, you guys know what this is. This is my Transformers Ben 10 display, my shelves. Now I've done a video on this before, but I am gonna do one pretty soon. That's an update because a lot of stuff has changed. But this isn't actually the focus of today's video. Now this is a big uh, part of myself that I have in my basement in my house. But there's even there's a bigger part. Well, just as big, kind of right next to it, that's just as important to me. And if we kind of pan over past the Ben 10, it's right here. And you guys have probably seen this in the background of a bunch of videos. But this is, I guess you want to call it my video game entertainment area. Video games, you guys know I'm obviously a huge fan of. I've done video games videos all the time, countdowns, uh, talking about videos like and games like Super Smash Bros., which you guys know I am super excited for. But this is where I spend a lot of my time, where I come to relax and play games. Um, so I figure i just show you this. Uh, so to the right, my shelves. To the left is my reviewing area, which is... Ugh, that needs to be cleaned up. I've got boxes, I've got things I've got to review, I've got things that need to be put away. But um, I guess we'll start uh, at, at the left. So over here, well, as you can see... I have this big, I guess you would call it entertainment area, or uh, entertainment set of a shelf. And over here on, on the left, we have all these, this bottom shelf. And, uh, well, right here we have a box of an item that I'm reviewing. You guys are going to see the review of that pretty soon. I'm super excited for that review. But uh, right here, on the lower section, we have uh, a big box of wires and manuals to the TV and just a bunch of other stuff that is just there. Uh, taking up space, and right there I have a box to a Wii U Pro Controller. I kept the box because I liked it. Uh, on the bottom here, we have four baskets. Um, the first basket, as you can see here, is all of my controllers, I guess you could say. Well, basically, yeah. Um, all of my main controllers are in here. I've got a Wii U Pro Controller, a WaveBird wireless GameCube controller, and I've got three Wii remotes in there. Uh, as you can see, um, the third one is actually upstairs with something else. Uh, I've got another GameCube controller. Surprisingly, being my favorite console, the GameCube, on TV, I only have two. I used to have, like, five, but a lot of them broke. Um, so there's the silver GameCube controller, and then I also have two nunchucks, one classic controller, which is right there. So, and I do... In case you guys, I guess, were wondering, keep this area, like, my gaming area, very, very neat. Nothing gets messed up here unless I do it myself. I keep this place very, very clean. Uh, next to that, we're going to move this. We'll get to that in two seconds. We have another box of, I guess, accessories for controllers. We have a Wii Wheel for Mario Kart, uh, the Wii U Draw, or the Wii Draw U, U Draw Gamepad. Uh, and another wheel for Mario Kart, so that is kind of just controller accessories. Uh, the third basket, as, as the baskets move over, it kind of gets less and less important. Uh, the third basket is a charger for wireless Wii remotes, but I have no wireless Wii remotes, so I have no need for this really. Someone gave it to me as a gift. Uh, the Nerf and Strike gun for Nerf and Strike the game. And the stands, in case you want to put the Wii U up straight, which I used to, but ever since I remodeled this, not anymore. And in here... It's just headphones, uh, 3D glasses for a 3D Toy Story game. That's about it. Nothing else. And then right here that I keep in front of it on a nice little stand is the Wii U gamepad. Uh, I love the Wii U. Great console. This is the gamepad, of course. You guys, if you have the Wii U, you know what that is. And then it, it has the wireless base, but then I also have the base that you can plug into charge under here. I pull that out when I need to charge it. Right there is the charger that I use an adapter to plug into the wall for the uh, Wii U Pro Controller. And then uh, moving back to the left and then panning up, we have my, my consoles that are plugged in. Now, you guys know I'm a big Nintendo fan. And basically, the majority of my stuff is Nintendo. Now, I do have a 3DS. I uh, love the 3DS. Fantastic console. My favorite. Uh, probably a little bit more than the GameCube. I think I've mentioned that. Um, but, yeah. Wii, right here. Uh, on its side. I used to have it standing up because I think the Wii looks better standing up. And on the right side, we have a Wii U, which is the black one. Which does look better laying down. But when I had the Wii standing up, I used those stands you guys saw to have the Wii 
U standing up. Uh, obviously, the gamepad goes with the Wii U. Uh, the Wii, very, very old. Uh, I got it, I think, the year it came out very early, very short after it was released, too. Obviously, you have a cable vision cable box here. As you can see, I'm recording this at 8.02. Uh, 8.02 a.m. or p.m.? Take a guess, it's p.m. Uh, on top, I have two sensor bars, one for the Wii, which I think the one for the Wii is the one on top, and the one for the Wii U is the one on the bottom. Uh, on right here, I have, if you guys know what the game is, I've mentioned it before, it's Project M. Project M is a thing you download onto an SD card, you stick it in your Wii, and it changes your Super Smash Bros. Brawl to make it, well, basically, if you're a fan of Melee, uh, better. You just, I keep this, I made a little case for it, and then you just take this SD card, and then you would plug it right into the Wii, and then turn on Brawl, go to Vault, and then it changes it. But a uh, nice little case I made for it. Uh, I had an SD card case, and then I made the little cover with the Project M logo on it. I keep that right there, because I'm always playing it. Uh, of course, we got the Wii U in black. One thing that I regret, or not regret, but wish, is that I had a black Wii, because you can see black cable box, black TV, black Wii U, and then white Wii, which just stands out. Uh, on top of the cable box, to the right of the sensor bar, and the left of the Wii U, is obviously my little Sonic figure. Um, I never really displayed this much. Uh, I kind of just had it on some random shelf where no one could really see it. And I figured this is a video game area, so why not have a video game character there? So, yep, there's a little Sonic figure. Uh, moving over, I guess we'll go up the shelves. Uh, by the way, down there is a couple of DS game boxes, but that's not really that important. Uh, we have uh, my games, and this is my GameCube here. Uh, you can see I have the WaveBird adapter plugged in, and the two memory cards that I do have. Um, this GameCube was plugged into my old TV, but when I got Wii U, a little bit after, I got an HD TV, which HD TVs have three HDMI ports, generally, and one AV connection. The AV has been used for the Wii, which leaves the GameCube unwired. Um, so, the GameCube isn't in use, but, you know, we plays GameCube games. I just like having it there. Looks nice. Um, and I guess we'll. I I guess I guess I'll name all the games. All right, why not? Uh, one thing you can't see. It's behind this pole. You can see I use book ends to hold up my games. Uh, we have Billy Hatcher for GameCube. Behind that is Tony Hawk's Underground, uh, Tetris Worlds, Namco Museum, Ice Age 2: The Meltdown, Spider-Man 2, Metroid Prime, obviously Nintendo classic. Uh, Star Fox Adventures, another classic. Rugrats Royal Royale, or Royal Ransom. Beach Bandits, I think that's Rocket Power. Yu-Gi-Oh! Dragon Ball Z, Budokai. Star Wars Bounty Hunter, Shamu's Deep Sea Adventure. Uh, Kirby Air Ride, which I lost the uh, paper to, so I just wrote it on myself. Kirby Air Ride. And then we come to my very small collection of Wii U games, which is Mario Kart 8, fantastic game. Super Mario 3D World, Sonic Lost World, Nintendo Land, Ben 10 Omniverse, and then... That's it for the Wii U games there, but then I also have this thing, which is a Game Boy game. This is the Game Boy Player. You guys, have, I featured this in a video once. You plug it into the bottom of the GameCube, you put a Game Boy game in there, put the Game Boy Player disc in the top of the GameCube, you can play Game Boy games on your TV. It's very cool, uh, but a lot of people know what it is. Uh, you got Pikmin 3, which my uncle gave me, but he lost the box on me, so I may just got my own, Pikmin 3. And then right here is Wii Sports, and then this little red thing is Rock Band 2 for Wii, but I lost the box. Um, so those are GameCube games, and then up here, we continue with the GameCube games, being Nicktoons Unite, the SpongeBob SquarePants movie, SpongeBob SquarePants Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. That's a great game. Uh, Mario Golf, Toadstool Tour, Mario Party 6, Mario Kart Double Dash. Again, great game. Uh, Disney Pixar Cars for GameCube. I've beaten that game multiple times. I really do love it, even though I haven't played it in a while. Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness, Pokemon Coliseum, Mega Man Anniversary Collection, which is one of the best purchases I've ever made in game-wise. Because it was, it gave me the ability to play Mega Man's one through eight, which is a great, great class. The classic series is amazing, so really happy I have that. Uh, Sonic Riders, Sonic Mega Collection. You guys know how much I love Sonic, so I got the bunch of Sonic games, and I have Mega Collection, uh, so I can play the classic Sonic one, two, th one through three. Sonic DX Adventure or Sonic Adventure DX Director's Cut, and then fantastic game you guys know I love uh, is Sonic Adventure Two Battle. Uh, Super Mario Sunshine, phenomenal game. Super Smash Bros. Melee, phenomenal game. Endless Ocean, 
terrible game. My, my sister got that. In case you guys were curious, my sister isn't one of those people who plays, like, dumb girl games. She is just as much a video game fan as I am and just knows just as much about it and loves it just as much as I do. Uh, we Fit, Sing It, Pop Hits. This is all my sisters. Sing It, Party Hits. Uh, Sing It, Boom Blocks, Rayman, Raving Rabbids. That was my first Wii game. Uh, Nerf and Strike, We Play. And, of course, I have to have it on the end right where I can get to it. The, f the glory of Wii, the Wii library, Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Uh... Again, my sister, big fan. We got iCarly, My Sims, Naruto, Clash, I can't see, Clash of Ninjas, uh, Dragon Ball, Revenge of King Piccolo, Bleach, Shattered Blade, You Draw Studio, Wii Sports Resort, Super Mario Bros. Wii, Super Mario Galaxy, Mario Party 8, Mario Kart Wii, Lego Batman, Lego Indiana Jones 2, Lego Indiana Jones, Sonic Unleashed, Sonic Colors, Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games, Wally. -E, Toy Story Mania, that's the 3D game I was talking about. Toy Story 3, Toon, Mater's Tall Tales. There uh, are Cars Toon, Mater's Tall Tales. Cars 2, Generator X, Agent of Providence, fantastic game. Ben 10, Protector of Earth, fantastic game. Ben 10, Alien Force, Ben 10, Alien Force, Vilgax Attacks. And Ben 10, Ultimate Alien, Cosmic Destruction. So there are basically all my console games right there. And I do have two more consoles that are technically my sister's because she got, when my sister gets a console for her birthday, it's hers. And p other people can play it, but it's hers. And she has to have it basically in her room. So technically, I have two more consoles being the PlayStation 2 and the Xbox 360 up in my sister's room. Which you guys know I play Transformers Fall of Cybertron and Sonic Generations on there. Those are mainly the two games that I play. But uh, yeah, so. To the left of that, we have my Skeptree uh, HDTV. Uh, not that big a deal. Uh, just average HDTV. I mean, it looks pretty good. You, you know, you turn it on. And then uh, just for a little demo, we'll turn on the Wii U. Then go to HDMI 2. You can hear the Wii U powering up. And wait for it. Wii U. Fantastic console, so we'll go here. Wii U menu on the gamepad. I was clicking stuff, but uh, yeah, Wii U is a uh, great, great console. You guys can listen to the uh, menu music as I keep talking. Uh, so, this isn't really a video game collection anymore, but above, in case you were wondering, above that, or the TV or that whole area, got a whole mess of stuff mainly. Stuff my mom has basically put up here. But uh, up here we have the Back to the Future Lego set. That's where I keep that because I don't really have a shelf for it. Uh, we have a little keychain that I got. Uh, I want to say two. Oh, sorry about that. I had to cut. But uh, this keychain is from Comic Con 2012. Uh, no, 2011, I think. Uh, three, three years ago, I got this at the Man of Action booth during Heroes United Ben 10 Generator X. Uh, the creators of the shows were giving these out, so I have that. I feel like it's kind of a collector's item, so I refuse to take that out of the packaging. And right here we have the little Minecraft figure of the Creeper. And just as a little heads up for you guys, I am in fact planning on reviewing this little dude pretty soon. But, um, yeah, and so this is an old case I used to use for my DS. Uh, we got books, a jar, a uh, bunch of useless stuff over there, some nice little cars I have with a nice little oil and can. But, uh, that's my gaming area. So, just to kind of recap, we've got wires, controllers, games, GameCube, Wii, Wii U, TV, cable box, and all my games. So, this is where I come to spend a lot of my time. I'll watch a lot of TV down here. Funny that that's on YouTube. This is a YouTube video. But this is where I spend a lot of my time. I love being here. I have chairs right there um, where I just plop them right here. I sit, play my games, have my shelves right next to me to look at. And this really is a wonderful area that I really do love. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. And uh, pretty soon, again, like I said, I'm going to be doing a shelf update. And I think I'm going to do a basement tour. Not a room tour, a basement tour. Because this is where I generally hang out. So, um, alright guys, uh, I guess that is about it, so, like I said, gaming area, let me know what you think of it, and, uh, alright, I'll see you next time, see you later, and have a great day. Game on. <laughs>